So I know you've seen it before where it actually draws on a circle to circle something on a video, just like I did with my face right there. I'm going to show you how to do it super quick here. It's incredibly easy. I'll go ahead and get out of the way so you don't miss anything. Now, just for purposes of this video, I'm going to go ahead and circle Patrick Mahomes face. He's just a professional football player. Now, what you need to do is go ahead and download a transparent background circle, or you can go ahead and make one into Vinci Resolve. It's not that hard either. Or you can go ahead and click the link in the description and you can download this exact circle. It looks like a paintbrush or a marker uh, brush and go ahead and download this. It's transparent background to work perfect for this case. Now, the first thing you're going to want to do is make sure if you use this exact one, make sure the open spot is at the top. We're going to turn this so the open spot is exactly at the top. And that's going to be exactly at minus 90. It doesn't have to be literally exactly. It'll be perfectly fine right there. Now, next up, what you're going to want to do, go ahead and grab go over to video transitions and grab clock wipe and drag and drop this on the front of the circle. Now, once it is there, you can see it goes ahead and draws on perfectly fine. Now, if you want it to look a little bit better, you can go ahead and click on the transition. And I believe anyways, you can either select in, out, in, out, or in and out. I'm going to go ahead and select in and out. And boom, I think that looks really good. Now, if you do resize this before doing the next step, it'll cause you problems. And I'll go ahead and show you exactly what it'll do. I'll resize it and put it around his face and it will not look correct. See how it went ahead and didn't swipe quite right. I'm going to go ahead and hold control, hit Z, go back, back, back. And there we are at the beginning again. So we have the transition drawing on correctly. What you're going to want to do from this point Make sure that the circle is at least as long as you need it, if not more. Always lean on the side of more. So we went ahead and made it way longer than we need. Go ahead and highlight the transition and the picture. Right click and go to new compound clip. Once, it co once it's a compound clip, you can go ahead and resize it. Any size you want it to have. And it'll go ahead and draw on perfectly fine. If you want to go ahead and circle his face. You can go ahead and do that now. This is the exact same size and place that it was before. And now it looks perfectly fine. Also, in this case, let's say you want to circle certain words or text in a paragraph or just wherever they're at. Go ahead and up here and undo the, the link at this point in the particular step. And you can go ahead and resize it any way you want to. You can make it wider. So this way you are actually uh, circling perhaps some text or something like that. In this case right here, it doesn't look quite right, but you can imagine there being text right there. So if this video helps you out, make sure you hit the like button and subscribe up for future super quick DaVinci Resolve tutorials.